Now a few words about a silent film, a rare gem thought to be lost forever, is found. Here's CBS's Adriana Diaz. Olivia Babler's painstaking work preserving films at the Chicago Film Archives is usually routine. That's a film. But sometimes, lightning strikes. She uncovered this 1923 Midwestern murder mystery, The First Degree. There's a villain with a great mustache and there's a great dog. When during the pandemic, she finally had time for long neglected reels that had come from a basement in Peoria, Illinois. It was thought to be lost forever, like 75% of other silent films. In the film world, this is a pretty big deal. There's a lot of folklore about lost films. There's something, can I say sexy? Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty sexy to find something like this. Most silent films have succumbed to decay or were destroyed by their own studios, says filmmaker and film historian Jim Hemphill. These things were disposable to them. They didn't understand the movie's value as cultural artifacts. They're not just about what they're about. They are reflections of their time. Which means they were often censored. Perhaps why this copy is missing a title screen that had justified murder, which was criticized in early reviews. Finding this film makes me wonder what archives would find if they had the resources and the time and the money that they need and that they deserve. Before these time capsules are lost forever. Adriana Diaz, CBS News, Chicago. They always say silence is golden.